Leper first. Dang, we have to go for a lucky hit here. 37? Oh, our boys are not playing around right now. Hey guys, Wigglings Gaming here, and welcome back to Darkest Dungeon 2, a story that will never seem to end for us. We've been pushing through time after time after time, countless deaths after deaths after deaths, but I feel good about this party. I mean, you can check it out below. We're not doing good currently, but I like where this party's at. We do have a guardian boss ahead of us, and that is pretty much the first major, you know, block in our way to the top of the mountain. For anybody that's new, Darkest Dungeon is a game all about strategy and making the best out of the worst possible situations. And sometimes your heroes are going to die, some bad things are going to happen, and they don't come back. Like, once your hero's gone, they're gone for good. So, keeping, keeping people alive, keeping everybody happy, and making it to the end, making it to the top of the mountain, that's the goal. We'll see if we can do it. Ah, uh, Guardian encounter. 22 flame. So they get a stab started off for them. He's, he threw some burning beads at us. 6 to 12, 20 hit points. 6. Do the bare minimum whatsoever. Jeez. Man at arms kind of has to take the punch. Oh my gosh. We'll go defender there. We need their stress to lower. Grenade to the back rank. Well done. That shaman in the far back, the far right hand side of your guys' screen right now is. With a, without a doubt, the worst thing. He's at 20. If I use this, I could get three. Just, ah, I guess we'll, we'll have time. We'll have time to, to de-stress ourselves later. Oh, and he resists the bleed. All right, we get hit, unfortunately. This guy, that guy right there, the shaman. Or not the shaman, the, um, like this dude holding the massive fire grenade. He is exactly what ruined our last run. He got way too close. So we're pushing him back right away. Relax. We're going to de-stress our Jester. Man-at-Arms takes that hit for our Leper. 50-50 chance. Thank you. Okay, woo. Play Grenade the back rank. They both resisted the Blight. They're doing a fantastic job of that, unfortunately. All right, so they're they're blinding our our front laners. Of course, he goes for a heal. The slow suffering begins. Good job. All right. Ah, uh, misses. It's unfortunate. Come on. Four. So hopefully those two guys die. We're going bolster on the Jester. Ah, oh, nice. The Jester lands for six, blinds him. He's just going to move forward anyway. But if he does get his attack off, it has a 50-50 chance of hitting everybody. Inspiring Tune will bring the Jester himself happiness. Actually, let's heal Man-at-Arms here. Help impeccably timed. 
de-stress yourself. Alright. I should cut through two of them. He gets closer. A deliberate and methodical appliance of harm. Reflection. Get some bleed. Okay, so he might die. Just in case he doesn't die, I'm shoving him back. Oh, I missed with the man at arms. We have to pray that he dies or that we get to act first. Yeah, they don't like each other, but it can get fixed over time. Dodge it. Good dodge. Remove the stress and heal yourself. I'm trying to de-stress the party. Relax. You guys need to relax. Go defender on the jester. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Go bolster on the jester. Wow. Shove this guy back. Daze him a little bit at least. Alright, Plague Doctor. Can we go ounce of prevention on everybody? It's not going to do anything, but I'm hoping that it will eventually... Actually, you know what? He resisted it anyway. Jester, just take it and be happy. You get rid of all your stress. There we go. And you please end him. He resisted it, so he has one. Four damage, got some bleed, no stress dealt. I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. What I'm doing right now is really just trying to postpone. I'm trying to get as much out of our poor team as I can get here. I think we are going to push a little bit further. I know I die every time doing this, but I'm, I'm going to try. Try to push further ahead here. They all get to go first. It's going to be rough. We have to hope that it's just not bad. No burning. Got a little bit of bleed there, but a little bit we can handle. He moves forward. You please go grenade. All right, no longer has a block. Go resist burn on our man at arms. Fifty fifty. No, go reflection. It's fine. We'll make sure we land our attack next turn. Just be happy with each other. I know you guys can do it. Relax, relax. Healing salve on ourselves. We'll defend the Jester. We're trying to make the Jester and the Man at Arms become better friends. They don't like each other right now, but. That won't always be the case, hopefully. Oh, you better be careful. My my uh, my leper's about to hit you. Okay. 
play grenade at the back a rank. Dissection. An unavoidable end. We eat that. Beautiful. Go bolster on the jester. He's not going to let us do it. It's fine. Then we're going to turn around and go defender on plague doctor. Turn around and go defender on plague doctor. Slice us off. No. Go forward. Yeah, get rid of his dodge. His dodge is gone now, so our leper has a free attack on him. 14. Beautiful. Look at that. He's down to one. Right, we're going to take four points of damage there. Not too much. Not, not a little bit, though. Of course, he's going to move forward. We have to desperately get our man-at-arms back in the correct position here. Play grenade back rank. Well done. All right, they're hurting at that back rank. The smallest variable can make all the difference. Ah, chop. Of course we miss. Man at arms, please. Shove him back. We need to keep that guy as far away from us as possible. Slice us off a piece of him. There we go. We got some bleed going for him. Now we desperately need to get rid of that shaman before she can heal him. Beautiful. She dies on her own from plague. All right. Here we're going to go ounce of prevention for actually no or not. We're going to go battlefield medicine. This wound at least has been tended to. This chop won't do anything. Reflection doesn't really do anything for us. Just go reflection. It's fine. There we go. Be happy with each other. Slice us off another piece of that pie, please. A slow dissection. Good job, guys. 40% damage. Do we push for that? This next fight is going to be insanely difficult. And we always lose doing this. Ah, I don't know, guys. Ah! Risky. All right. So we've fought this guy before, and we know exactly what to do. Like, exactly what to do. And it is grenades, grenades. Kill these guys at the back rank as soon as possible, because they can heal him. And he already does crazy amounts of damage. Grenades, grenades. Slice us off a slice. That's six. Come on, we gotta we gotta get rid of those guys ASAP. And they just keep buffing buffing Mr. Guy in the front here. Let's go. Heal yourself and de-stress yourself. And for you, I'm in command here, me. Yeah, okay, bud. Healing salve, play doctor. A little help, impeccably timed. Along with that, we're gonna go bolster, and we're gonna de-stress our jester. Round two. They're coming straight back after our jester. They have horror on him. That's very unfortunate. Our jester can go ahead and de-stress himself. All right, go ahead. Ow. We resist it. He doesn't have his block, so... Let's go withstand. We need to be ready to take this next hit. Yeah, I understand you guys don't like each other. I'm aware. 
take the defense. And you kill that back rank. All right, he's almost down to one. Steady yourself. All right, we all absorbed it. We're alive. That's what matters here. They're healing him. Of course they are. He hasn't taken any damage though, because we're we're choosing not to not to attack him outright. All right, one of you guys is down. Our attacks are weaker, unfortunately. We're gonna remove our stress and kind of just stay in the front lane to block anything that we can. Continue to bolster our Jester, de-stressing him. And again, play grenade. This time landing and this time doing damage. Yeah. You have to kill this guy's little helpers before you even start attacking him. There we go. He no longer has allies to help him in this fight. So that means we can turn our attention. Does he debuff minus 40? Maybe we could shove him back. He resisted it. Of course he did. I'm not surprised. Slice us off a piece of the pie. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Drop some blight on him. A oh yeah, that's beautiful. All right, we're hurting him. Anxiety forms insidious fears. That was some damage. Have some more. Yeah, you guys don't like each other. We get it. We're trying to fix it. We are trying to fix it. Okay. Don't kill him. Don't kill our man at arms. Dragged back from the brink. We're gonna get him off death door. Oh, of course. Try to throw him back, maybe. He's dazed, that'll give us some time. We miss our attack, unfortunately. Unfortunate. We do get to act first. There we go. See, you guys can be nice to each other. Strengthens the bond. See, they don't hate each other anymore. You... You stress yourself. You stress the man-at-arms. In crisis... We can rely only upon each other. All right, he's at death's door. So any moment forward could be his last. We take that like a champion. I mean, we, we take a little damage, but hey, this is what we're used to. There we go. Did a little bit of de-stressing at the end there. Not a, not a lot, but hey. But look at all these goodies. With that moving forward, I think we can do some crazy amounts of damage with our leper. Uh, of course we're over encumbered, but... Trinkets. If Dark Pulse is equipped, 40% more damage. Dark Impulse. Here, you could have the Death Resist for now. I wish I could see his base combat attacks. Maybe I can. 6 to 12. Still, still says 6 to 12, but... Dark Impulse, yeah. His damage should be insane now. Our Plague Doctor is looking very good too. 
I give him more blight resist, but not needed right now. I mean, yeah, these trinkets aren't really needed right now. Do we have anything we could throw away? Combat items. I'm going to need all the food I have. I guess we're dropping these trinkets. Something. It's not, not good, but it's not, not bad. Uh... I don't know here, guys. I can't believe we won that, too. How insane is that? Sure, we'll get rid of Blight Resist. Keep Bleed Resist. Does everybody have any more? Oh, yeah. You can hold that. And then you can hold the Stimulants. You could drop those Bleed Resist Stimulants and... Removes all negative tokens. That sounds pretty good to me. I suppose we will drop a little bit of food. All right, guys, off to the inn. Pockets laden with gold. Massive boss defeated. Feeling good. Party is. I don't think. Any, I don't think they hate each other anymore. I mean, they definitely don't like each other, as you can tell from the bottom right there, but. It's because they're stressing out so much. I think we can get some much needed uh, rest and relaxation here. Whew. I was so nervous to fight that boss, guys. You have no idea. Oh, every time we've pushed to there. For a time. Every time we've pushed there, it's been bad. Each improvement, a new variable in the equation of your fate. Okay, so if we have to go to the fodder, it's going to be better. Let's see the where we can go. Tribes of our land, crumbling and undone. A reward? What is the fight at? No more than one resistance encounter for 500 hope. Or avoid the hoarder. Mud and rain. Resignation. Actually, you know what? Death. We can avoid the hoarder. This land is truly barren. And the reason why we're going... Ooh. What is that? Oh, the Shambler's Altar. Okay. And the reason why we're going towards the fodder is because we now have this bad boy equipped on our stagecoach, which is going to help tremendously. 15% uh, damage for the entire party. The and means then... of mastery. Mastery tokens. I'm going straight towards Slice Off to do even more damage. And then Inspiring Tune to de stress even more. Okay. Uh, in items, first things first. Let's get our. Everybody feeling good here. There we go. Everybody is feeling better. Chance of purging a negative quark. Who has the worst negative quark? I'm um, not too... I don't care about those. Um, if Blight, Burn Start, the Yips. Okay, I think we're going to go for... Probably Germaphobe. Oh, she has a huge blight resistance. We'll go with Jester for negative two stress and the chance of removing a quark because he could get rid of um, the yips or the other one. He didn't get rid of the one that we wanted him to, but it's okay. Minus two stress, minus two stress, drink your problems away. Minus two stress, minus two stress, drink your problems away. Enjoy chance of removing a negative quark. Again, it didn't take one away this time, unfortunately. 
All right. Dodge token for our Plague Doctor. Shield, shield, move resist. Oh my gosh, guys, we are doing so good right now. Look at that. Plenty of coin to spare, too. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. Ooh, reduces the chance of negative banter. I think I want that, guys. I know it's going to cost all my coins, but if they stop fighting with each other so much while we're on the road, it'll help the party out a lot. This will serve well. All right, guys. 32 of those can't really get any trinkets. We're going to have to sit, sit with trinkets for a little while. Yeah, I think we're good. Let's uh, let's jump on the road and embark with a fresh party. Feeling fantastic. Feeling good. I believe we have to avoid the hoarder in this one, which shouldn't be an issue because we have no longer have any coins to give them in the first place anyway. So, welcome to the fodder. Our party should not be playing any games. And abhorrent. Yeah, avoid the hoarder. We'll let the map keep going, but obviously we can't go. We can't go uh, straight. Or not straight to the hoarder to the right. They do want us to go. Two of them want us to go to the watchtower, so that's where we'll go. Stress one guy out, but hey. I also agree we should be going towards the watchtower so we can see what is on the road ahead of us. Flame's good too. I mean, we're our loathing's pretty bad. But that that just happens. I I don't have to tell it. Watchtower. There we go. We should figure out uh what what is, what is exactly is in store for us ahead here. Let us see. So it looks like we have an oasis and a cache, a supply cache. So just got to take note that the only person that is stress isn't stressed is our leper. So once we get to that oasis, he's the only person we shouldn't be focusing on unless this fight changes things, which it could. These these heroes don't play around. We're gonna go clotting powders on our leper here. At the same time, we're going to go get rid of this woodsman. A slow dissection, an unavoidable end. All right, he lands a stun on our plague doctor. That's unfortunate, but hey. 50-50 chance to nine to 19 damage. 11, I'll take it. Forget your dodge. Let's go stimulants on our leper. Oh yeah, his next attack is going to be crazy. And they're happy. And they're happy. Very good. Alright, so we're going to try to get rid of his dodge. His dodge is gone. Unfortunately, her stun is now too. Yeah, that hurts, but not as bad as we wanted. And we resisted that bleed. Here we're gonna go for a slice again. Misses. It's directed. Play grenade. Bleed and blight. Stumbling and stupefied. All right. 50-50. We need this not to be a 50-50. It lands. Oh, 27 damage. That is wicked. 
Oh my gosh. Woo! Go Defender on the Jester. Make him feel happy again. That was damage, guys. Okay, yeah, you can block. It's fine. Oh, yeah. It doesn't matter who's in front of us. We'll cut them down. Yeah, we don't we don't stun the man at arms. Give him some more stimulants to our leper. Emboldened. And then try to get rid of his dodge. Alright, he's no longer guarded, but we haven't got rid of his dodge. Uh he is hurting. We go one more hit point for him. All right, he does get some bleed on us there, unfortunately. Leper first, dang. We have to go for a lucky hit here. 37? Oh, our boys are not playing around right now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, our boys do not care. They said, forget it. We don't care. We'll just bolster the Jester. Why not? All right, he's at death's door. He's vulnerable, he's weak, he's dead. Good job, guys, fantastic job. An inkling of potency still lingers in some of these well-worn relics. Ranged attacks do plus 20 damage. Maybe for you, the Plague Doctor? A higher blight re- No, we're, we're, we are in a place that needs blight resist. We are in a place that needs Blight Resist, this is for sure. But what else is for sure is we are unfortunately out of time for today's episode. If you guys enjoyed Darkest Dungeon 2 and want to see more of it, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell icon to get notified when we post new episodes. And also feel free to leave a like and a comment down below. As always, welcome to the wild side. Thanks, you guys.